Welcome to People Power in Politics. Hard talk, riveting interviews, community updates, in depth analysis. That's People Power in Politics. We tell it to you as it is. No holds barred. You are the people, you have the power. We bring you the politics. To listen to our show, be a guest, or to advertise, visit www.pppradio.nyc. That's www.pppradio.nyc. Latest political news in New York. Welcome to our segment, where we delve into the latest developments politics in New York. In this segment, we discuss the latest on Trump's hush money trial and Mayor Eric Adams' FBI corruption probe. We begin with City Hall aide turns witness in corruption probe involving Adams. A significant turn has occurred in the corruption investigation surrounding Mayor Eric Adams as his former aide, Rana Abasova, has reportedly begun cooperating with federal authorities. Abasova, who previously served as Adams's liaison to the Turkish community, is now providing valuable information to investigators probing into alleged misconduct during Adams's 2021 campaign. This development sheds new light on the inquiry, which includes suspicions of potential collusion between Adams's campaign and the Turkish government to funnel illegal foreign contributions. Additionally, Authorities are scrutinizing whether Adams exerted undue influence on fire department officials to approve a controversial high-rise Turkish consulate despite safety apprehensions. Abasova's cooperation represents a significant breakthrough in unraveling the complexities of the investigation. Her role within Adams's administration as the director of protocol for the mayor's Office for International Affairs affords her insight into various interactions between Adams and Turkish officials and business people. Emails suggest her involvement in coordinating events and meetings within the Turkish community and arranging the mayor's travel, including accompanying him on official trips to Turkey. While the specifics of Abasova's cooperation remain undisclosed, her first-hand knowledge of Adams's engagements with Turkish entities could prove pivotal in unraveling the intricacies of the investigation. Trump will not testify in his criminal trial as defense rests. In the latest development of Trump's hush money trial, his defense team made a strategic move by resting their case without calling former President Donald J. Trump to testify. The decision came after just two witnesses took the stand. The trial is entering a crucial phase, with the jury dismissed until next Tuesday for closing arguments. However, the court still has more to address including jury instructions and a last-ditch effort by Trump's lawyers to sway the case in their favor. They argue that Michael D. Cohen, Trump's former fixer, provided misleading testimony regarding a $130,000 hush money payment to a porn star on the eve of the 2016 election, a payment allegedly reimbursed by Trump. The final witness, Robert Costello, previously an informal legal advisor to Cohen, became a focal point of the trial. Prosecutors attempted to depict him as an agent of Trump, influencing Cohen's cooperation with investigators. Tensions escalated when Justice Merchant rebuked Costello during his testimony, leading to a dramatic courtroom exchange. The charges against Trump involve allegations of falsifying business records to conceal the hush money repayments made to the porn star. Trump maintains his innocence, denying any wrongdoing or sexual involvement with the woman in question. As the trial adjourns for an extended break until after Memorial Day, jurors have been instructed to avoid discussing the case or following trial news. Cohen's testimony, detailing an agreement to suppress negative stories about Trump, has been central to the prosecution's case, while Trump's defense portrays Cohen as a vindictive liar seeking revenge. Notably, Trump's presence in court was accompanied by his eldest son, Don Jr., marking the departure from previous appearances. Chuck Zito, a former Hells Angels leader, also joined Trump's entourage for a second consecutive day, adding intrigue to the courtroom proceedings. Stay tuned for more political news update. People power in politics, hard talk, riveting interviews, community updates, in-depth analysis, that's people power in politics. We tell it to you as it is. No holds barred. You are the people. You have the power. 
we bring you the politics. To listen to our show, be a guest, or to advertise, visit www.pppradio.nyc. That's www.pppradio.nyc.